Yes. Are you the forgiving kind? I am, yes. It's a, it's a great failing. It's a failing? It's a great failing. I have it too. I don't carry a grudge. Well, you don't carry a grudge, but you don't remain friends with people who have done no, something no, horrible no, to you. No, but, so. but I don't think about it. You think about it a lot? I think about everything so much. Oh, really? So, yes. Uh, my, I have this chattering voice, this chattering mind, and it just doesn't stop. And nothing can make it stop. Do people hurt you a lot? Uh, I'm a sensitive little thing. And, um, I'm very interested in poetry and the poetic side of life. And so, obviously, it's hard in modern life because there's no poetry in modern life. There's nothing very nice about modern life. It's very difficult. So, yes, I, I feel pangs and very easily. Emma, on the Larry King Now blog, you've talked very openly in the past about your struggles with depression. Has it gotten better over time? What advice would you give to people struggling with it and their loved ones who give their support? Well, I, for me, it didn't ever get better. I've had it for many, many years, and it's, um, I refer to it as the black dog, and it doesn't go away. Churchill had uh, yes, Lincoln had. Yes, yes, and it's usually the very first thing uh, when you wake up in the day or the morning whenever you wake up but there is no cure and I think it's part of being a, a sensitive open human and do you get how do you get better through the day not really not really no. you're depressed now um not now because I'm here with you and I feel quite safe and uh, I've cured you no you haven't no. <laughs> no you take medication I don't but I've, I've been through everything. It's just completely pointless. It really is. It's, it's a frame of mind, a state of mind, and it's uh, circumstantial mostly. And you never thought, I hope, of harming yourself. No, but many others have. Of harming you. Yes. <laughs> uh...